when you log in with your account you can look into your computer and when you open up my computer you'll notice that some of the items on the computer for example the C drive, the floppy drive and the D drive correspond to physical items within the computer box itself while other items listed under network drives um, may represent something that's not on the computer but that's on a shared area or a certain area of the network so that no matter what computer you sit at you can access that information. Now your own personal area of the computer has your own ID for example this user 09SA17's ID shows that, that uh, is mapped to the H drive on the server so that person's data is contained in that area. When the user first accesses their personal drive, you should notice that it's blank. So we're going to set up some holders for our information for each module. So to do that, you just click on File, and New, and Folder. Start typing the name of some of your modules. So we're going to start here with Word Processing. And we'll set up another folder for this user for database methods. Oops, made an error. So you can just go back and set it up again. You can keep on going until you set up a folder for each of your modules. Okay, another area if we just pop back into the main my computer main uh, my computer window is the share drive now this is a handy area if you wish to pick up a handout just like you do in the real class environment you can pick up a handout take your own copy and work on your own copy of that handout so if you visit the share drive very important i'll just pick up a file here from the word processing folder just as an example i'll pick up the ib file it's very important however that you right click take a copy of the file and before you work it on, your, on it yourself you bring it away from this S drive area and then all the way back to your personal drive and because we're working on the word processing module area here just paste it in and there's our file in our word processing folder ready for us to open and work on it ourselves. That's just a little bit about basic file and folder management in LCFE.